Hey YouTube it is, I'm the Black Cat and this is Darkest Dungeon. Alright. Now I think we went over stress relief and all that last time. So we've got That is our antiquarian in the treatment ward there, getting rid of something. I don't know, it's been a, a while, so about a week since I've played, so can't exactly remember, but we've got some stress relief going as well, I think. Yeah, a bit of stress relief going there, and I think that's about all. And everyone that I'm using is upgraded in both skills and weapons. And I think I filled out the roster as well with a few level zeros. So, apart from that, yeah, nothing much to spend. Upgrade-wise, don't really have enough, so may as well embark. Now, I have a bonus for the Ruins. Plus 33% resolve XP and plus 15% damage. And on top of that, I am going to go and try and kill a boss again. It's been a while since I've tried that, and last time it went horrendously. Or at least I think it did, from memory. Um, but this time uh, it'll probably also go horrendously, but I have enough money stockpiled that I should be able to recover fairly easily. So I'm going to be taking out a Hellion. Hang on, I'll just sort this by activity. I'm taking out a Hellion, a Abomination, a Grave Robber, and a Plague Doctor. So I'm going to probably mainly try to do some Blight damage. Who am I supposed to kill the Necromancer Apprentice? I think that should work. <coughs> Gra Sorry about that. The Grave Digger there is going to be there to clean up. And... Uh, with the range damage, and my Hellion's going to be the heavy hitter there, so just see who needs anything equipped. No one really. Just see what we've got available for the Plague Doctor. He loses some maximum HP there, that's not so good. Plus 33, 30% 30 stun. That's not terrible, so I'll put that on. Anything that adds blight damage. 5% HP. You know what, I can probably live with that. As for the rest, I think they're fairly fine as they are. I won't bother filling them up too much. Alright. Let us go. Gonna need probably a full stack of shovels and maybe one more. Two full stacks of torches. Two full stacks of food. Uh, we have some antivenom ruins, not sure. Um, probably bandages is what I need, but I won't even bother with. Oh no, I'll take two of those. Two keys. Three herbs. One more anti-venom, why not? And holy water. 150, all right, I'll buy one. And embark. Doesn't leave me with I much space. Life and death was chief among my early pursuits. I began in humility, but my ambition was limitless. Who could have divined the prophetic import of something as unremarkable as a twitch? in the leg of a dead rat. Sorry, didn't want to interrupt the narrator there. Um, doesn't leave me with a lot of space for treasure. Only the mad or the desperate go in search of him. So, uh, but, uh, we have things that we can drop here. Okay. There's the holy water. Alright, it was worth it. <laughs> Already until I have to drop all this stuff here. Ooh, good scouting. Okay, room battle. Room battle with Curio, all right. All right. Bad knowledge. Oh, hang on. Minus 20%? Okay, that's pretty good. 
That was a, a very lucky roll there, I think, to get a good quirk from that, because usually you only get bad stuff from books. I, I shouldn't even be taking them, but... Ooh. Well, first things first. We need to take out probably the courtier. Yes. Um, I might stun the crawler. Good. Ah. And you got pulled forward, that's pretty bad. Disorienting blast. On you. Good, stun. And move you forward. Breakthrough. Good. That'll move me up and does some good damage across the board on their side. Uh, now who do we have? Flashing daggers. Oh yeah, get them both. You're wonderful. Just a wicked hack. And done. Ooh, plenty of stuff. Okay, first things first. Eat the food. <laughs> Holy Fountain. Ah, it's just a bit of healing. Okay, we've got a battle down here as well. I don't want to go into that. Oh, alright, we'll have a look at the lock display cabinet with a key. Oh, there's a ton of money in there. What do I lose, though? Onyx. No, I think I get rid of the citrine. For now, could get rid of any number of other things, but no, probably the shovel might have been the best thing, but... <coughs> okay, very easy battle here. Lunge, or just... No, I think I'll just throw a dagger here. Another easy kill. Damn, that Grave Robber is so good. Uh, get a stun in as well. So he won't even get a turn. May as well use some Battlefield Medicine. I probably should have used it on the Grave Robber there actually, but... Another one falls. At least lost a little bit of health that it would have helped with. More money. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Alright. Full light. Oh no, not quite full light, but high light. I'll go the long way around. Especially because we've got the shovels to use. Good. Another locked display cabinet. Ah, oh, Wish you wouldn't have done that. I think you must have curiosity. Ooh, a chest. Probably a better use of a key anyway. Now, let's get some Beast Bile going here. Got Blight on both of them, good. Poison Dart on the first one here. And a Play Grenade. Get even more Blight going here. These are, really are a high Blight set. If it bleeds, maybe. Adrenaline Rush? Nope. I'm just going to go for a wicked hack. Could kill you, so I'll try that. No, not quite, but I think the blight will finish you off. Alright. You probably die on your next turn. Uh, you need a bit more damage, though. You're dead. Uh, that'll probably kill them both. Oh, and a crit. Put some manacles on the first guy. Good, stunned. Oh, only just survived. A little bit of damage with his bayonet, though. Use some battlefield medicine. Ooh, crit, nice. Oh, 
All right. You are dead. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Well and truly dead. Yeah, just throw a dagger. He's dead. Ooh, some nice stuff there. What do I drop? I think I drop... Probably the anti-venom for the deeds. And the bandages for the bust. Use a key here. Alright. Probably would have found one that's better later on, but... Oh, it is what it is now. Didn't even see a trap there. Cruel machinations spring to life with a singular purpose. Fairly easy battle, so long as I get rid of these two courtiers. Get some beast file in there. And get some plate grenade up in there. Maybe a breakthrough? Ooh. Flashing daggers will kill them both. You get one tempting goblet in, which... All in all, doesn't really matter. Uh, you full on dead. Oh no. Got two in. That's unfortunate. You need to heal. Just throw a dagger at him. Is broken. Maintain the offensive. See, I'm running out of room massively here. Although, those two food there make things quite a bit easier. Alright. Room battle with treasure again. Ah. Press the wrong key. Oh well. Oh, a bit more money. Disarm the trap too. Good. Alright, one more torch. And now we've got some more space. Good. Start off with some flashing daggers. Ooh, get some debuff in there, good. Beast Bile should do some nice damage in the form of the Blight, good. Get a Disorienting Blast on him. Stunned him, good. Now, just a wicked hack. Good, he's nearly dead. Three health. Oh, bit of bleed here though. That should kill one of them at least. Yep. Great is the weapon that nice. Its own. Definitely stun you. So I think we might get one attacking. Yes, good. We could hack, we'll finish you off. Use some battlefield medicine. Get rid of the bleed, good. And throne dagger to finish things off. I really like this team. Success so clearly in view. Or is it Okay. Oh good. Fight? Oh damn. What do I get rid of for busts? Maybe the jades. I think I have to get rid of the medicinal herbs. It's about all I can do. 
I mean, I would get rid of the the jade, but I think it's better off to keep it for now because it might stack up higher. Beast bile. Disorienting blast. Maybe bring you to the front. No, but it's done at least. Flashing daggers. Good. Oh, killed one. Even better. Okay, he'll get one attack in. No, he won't. He's dead already. One attack. And he's done. Be wary. Lightstone. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Plus 20% blight skill chance, minus one speed. Mm, now what do I get rid of? I don't think I get rid of anything just yet. 750 worth there. Fine, I'll take the gold, but I'll leave the blight stone. Is struck. A blazing star is born. Sort of really hard to decide what you should be taking and what you should be leaving behind. Oh, good. Got a torch. Confession booth, maybe? A ah, little bit of gold. That's good. Another room battle, I'm guessing. Yep. Okay. Beast pile, the middle. Now, oh, don't push you to the back. Good. Now I think I poison dart the back. Then play grenade, the back two. Masterfully executed. Ooh, crit. Okay, bit of damage. Oh, and bleed. Not the greatest. Okay, he won't survive another turn, so we don't have to worry about him. I could kill you, so I may as well try. Good. Blade, not great, but only does damage. Get a poison dart going on this defender. Good. Blight is up. Now stun him. Good. Oh, you survive one more turn. Not for long. Because your friend's not even getting that much. <laughs> oh, you're dead. They're both dead. So I should heal. If I can. Yes. Absolution. Um. Pass how much stress? Five. Okay. I think that was worth it though. Bit of healing. A death by inches. <laughs> now I can extra jade after I've gotten rid of the rest. Oh, but I want two of the same trinket on that hero. <laughs> oh well, he's getting left behind then. Okay, empty room down here. 
So we go to this empty room, then we come back, and then we use the campfire. Nothing but ashes in there. All right. Room is empty. Head on back. Let the torch go down as well. Because the campfire is going to take care of that for me. Okay. Feast. Okay, stress relief. Um, extra scouting chance. One companion minus stress. Uh, nothing much there for you. Oh, okay, you encourage you. You encourage you. Quickening. There's nothing really else here I want to use. Scouting chance, maybe. That's about it. Callow's humor, no use. left. Huh? Well, that's about all I can do. The light, the Good, didn't get a battle. One battle in this room though, or in this hallway. And there it is. Again, beast bile. Flashing daggers. Oh, killed him. No acolyte for me. Disorienting blast. May as well. Then a wicked hack. Killed him. And you're dead as well. Free damage, so you may as well heal up here. Throw a poison dart. Battlefield medicine. Ooh, crit for two. Good. Adrenaline rush. And he's dead. Good. Got a key, good. Ooh, loot, good. What sort of loot? Another jade. Never should have got rid of those jades. But you never can tell which is the ones that are never going to show up again. Okay, final room. What in the world is that? Torch? No. Not oh, just a buff. Just a buff. The way is lit. The path is clear. All right, here we are. We require only the strength to follow it. This is my boss battle. Okay. Nightmare made material. Cannot get him on that. Might be able to use the manacles though and stun him. Yes. Wicked hack. Definitely poison him. Good damage on the poison as well. 
Use some battlefield medicine. Simply because I can't attack you just yet. Might be able to stun you again though. Nah, he resisted. Oh dear. At least he's back one. Which means that I can maybe stun him again. <laughs> and I do. Move him to the front though, which is unfortunate. We could hack. We'll help. Stack more poison on him. Eight damage, good. I think I use my manacles on you. I oh, resisted. Oh well, it's not too bad. Throne dagger will do. That's not going to work, is it? I don't know. So we may as well kill. Let's do ten to twenty-one, but it'll move him to the front. I'm going to try that. Did 10. Good. Maybe get a disorienting blast on you. Move you to the front. Yeah. Then I'll use a breakthrough to move up. Let's kill his friend. Good. Flashing daggers. Another 7 damage. Good. Oh, I think I've got this in the bag. I don't think I'm going to have any problems at all. No stun, alright. Sorry, ending blast, maybe. Nope. Wicked hack. 16, oh you're very nearly there. One more, throne daggers. You're dead. Whoa. That went fantastic. Stunned. A bit of healing here. Um, yep, that'll do. Finish it off. As victories mount, Get rid of that. So too will resistance. Get rid of the torches. Take those two charms. And we're done. Alright. Well, that was fairly straightforward and simple. So we've got uh, Hell's Hairpin, which is a very rare alien item. Um, plus, minus 10 debuff resist, minus 10 bleed resist. Not exactly sure what that is. Whether you have less chance of resisting it, or more. No, I think that's less chance. Anyway, apart from that, a bunch of gold, some busts, some crest. Seven and a half grand in loot, and uh, eight busts, two deeds, and twenty crests, which is quite nice. Oh, resolve. Obsessed with material things. Fast heal is good. Unholy stray is good. Stout. Replaced clutch hitter. Doesn't really matter, I don't think. All right. Fosters skill and confidence. Ooh, idle arbalists gain one resolve level. So I'll be leaving the arbalists behind next time. And that's about it. So, thanks for watching guys. I've been the Black Cat and this has been Darkest Dungeon. If you like this video, feel free to hit that like button and subscribe if that's what you're into. Until next time, see you later.